Welcome to another episode of ACTV Live. I am Jack Holmes. My name is Elliot Harper. Uh, so me and Elliot actually, along with the rest of the seniors and the junior class, had a good time yesterday. What did we do yesterday? Oh yeah, we went to uh, the state capitol here. We went and watched the House and the Senate do all their stuff. Go through bills and everything like that. Me yeah. and Elliot and Andy went uh, down to the Capitol Pond and fed the geese for a while, so that that, that was fun. Go <laughs> wait, yeah. feed the geese. Yeah, yeah. yeah. a couple of good memories of that. We, yeah. we threw some crackers in the water. All the ducks from <laughs> on the land was like a like a waterfall. Of ducks. So we <laughs> in the water. Unreal. It was a great experience. But uh, first, we're gonna send it off to Briar with Kids New Adventure. I'm Briar Close for HGTV Live. I'm here with. Elliot. So, Elliot, what grade are you in? Fourth. Fourth grade. Uh, how's school been going? Good. Good. Favorite subject? Math. Math. Learn anything new in math? Roman, Roman numbers. Roman numbers. Roman numbers. <laughs> Not bad. Um, what's your favorite thing to do in recess? Soccer. Soccer? Do you make a lot of goals? No. No. That's okay. Never did either. And I'm here with? Jacob. So, Jacob, uh, what grade are you in? Fifth. Fifth grade. How's school been going? Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, favorite subject right now? Math. Math? Something, what's something new you've learned in math? Kind of just to stand still then, kind of haven't been learning much. Yeah, we, we'll kind of like that too. Um, favorite thing to do in recess? Play basketball. Play basketball. That's pretty good. Post. You down below. You make a lot of baskets. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. And now I'm here with. Kylie. So Kylie, uh, what grade are you in? Sixth. Sixth grade. How's school been going? Good. Good. What's your favorite subject? Science. Science. Have you learned anything new in science? Yeah, we're learning about um atoms. Atoms. That's cool. Um. Favorite thing to do at recess? Soccer. Soccer. Do you make a lot of goals? No. I no. just kick it. Yeah. Back to the desk. Thank you, Briar, for those interviews, as always. Yeah. So now we'll send it to Jacob for weather. Hey, this is the weather, man. Uh, for your seven day forecast in Hitchcock this week. For Friday, we have a high of 20, a low of 10. Saturday is a high of 48, low of 3. Sunday is a high of 21, low of 6. Monday is a high of 41, low of 20. And then Tuesday is a high of 35, low of 17. Wednesday, we have a high of 39, a low of 20. And Thursday is a high of 42, low of 17. For your seven day forecast in Tula this week, uh, for Friday is a high of 20, a low of 10. Saturday is a high of 48, low of 3. Sunday is a high of 21, low of 6. Monday is a high of 41 and a low of 20. Tuesday is a high of 35, low of 17. And Wednesday is a high of 39, low of 20. Thursday is a high of 42 and low of 17. Back to you. Thank you for that weather update, Jacob. It's going to be cold here for the next couple of days. Oh. Up and down, up and down, we're looking like that. But, uh, it's starting to feel like winter. Not looking like winter. Still. So. Luckily, what? luckily that snowstorm dodges, but, uh, uh, is it lucky? Anyway, we will be sending it to Zach with sports. Yeah. I'm here with the sports update. So the girls basketball team played Sully Buttes on the 27th last Thursday. They lost 34 to 61. Uh, on the 29th, at last Saturday, they played Falcon. Uh, they lost 24 to 47. And then this last Tuesday, the girls played James Valley Christian in Hitchcock, and they lost 36 to 50. For the boys, um, the last Thursday, they played Sully Buttes as well in Tulare. They lost 40 to 48. Um, and this last Tuesday, they played James Valley Christian, and they won that 68 to 61. Thank you. Now I'm here with Coach Smith now. Uh, Coach Smith, you played Sully Buttes last Thursday. Uh, any words on that? You know, Sully Buttes is a very talented team. Um, they got off to a hot start. But I was really proud of our girls for, you know, battling throughout the whole entire game. 
And, you know, that we just can't afford to get down in that hole right away. That really that really took a toll on us. Yeah. Uh, then last Saturday you guys played Falkton. Uh, anything on that? Yeah, you know, it was a tough week for the Lady Patriots last week. We played a lot of great uh, teams, and that's what you need to do in order to get better. You know, Falkton, um, they have a, a winning record, and they once again got off to a hot start in that first quarter, and that's something that we really need to work on is, you know, setting our tone defensively right away and not digging ourselves into that hole. So um, once again, though, our girls came back in the fourth quarter and kept fighting, so that's definitely a takeaway. But um, just need to learn from those losses and, and keep moving forward. Yeah, uh, we got some big games coming up this week. Uh, any words on that, those games? Yeah, we start our more of our conference um, schedule. So far, we've only played two regular season conference games. The girls are one and one in that. And so, you know, just really looking ahead to what we have left, you know, we set some goals and what we want to accomplish with um, these conference games coming up. And definitely a big rivalry game tonight versus James Valley. That's always fun. The gym always seems to get packed. And then, you know, we go to SBA on Friday. Um, not a conference game on Saturday, but we play um, Dubrick, which is a Class A school. It'll be a good battle for us. And um, then, you know, head into the next week with another home match versus Highmore Herald. So a lot of home games coming up. We look forward to playing those and just trying to get some W's. Yeah, well, good luck. All right, thank you. Yep. Thank you, Zach, for uh, sports updates. Well, looks like I got to do birthdays now. As always. Happy birthday to these people here. Let me read it. Here. Happy birthday to Bentley Knoll, uh, Blaze Binger. This middle name is terrorist. <laughs> uh, Cora Mussinger, Max Gilbert, uh, uh, Layla Flea. Chandler Schultz, Olivia Becker, and Riley Knott. So happy birthday, guys. And also, I have the upcoming events. So on uh, February 4th, we have no school, which is tomorrow. No school this Friday at all. And girls, our girls and boys basketball team will be traveling to SBA to take on the Crusaders. And then on the 5th, this Saturday, girls and boys will play Dubrook and Hitchcock. And then on the 7th, there's junior high girls and boys basketball at Highmore Herald. And that is at the school auxiliary gym, not at the regular gym we're playing. There will not be concession stands at that. And also, or, and then on the 8th, uh, we have girls and boys basketball versus Highmore Herald. And that is our senior night for our seniors that are in basketball. So we'll have a good time with that deal. Oh, we And then <laughs> on February 10th, we have girls and boys basketball at or versus your boys Dolan at Dolan. So, yeah, that's sounds good. Yeah. As always, folks, thank you for tuning in to another episode of ACTV Live. I am Ron Burgundy. I'm Brian Fantana. Stay classy, Hitchcock, too. <laughs>